Now, you're going to have to forgive me. I, I know I shouldn't do this right now on the stage, but if I don't do it now, I'm going to go absolutely mad. I do apologize. <laughs> what am I doing? What am I doing? Yeah. What am I doing? Yeah. I am going to get you something that you have not had for a very long time. <laughs> I mentioned it to that lady down there the other day. It's something that you need very badly. That's true. And something that will get you up in the morning. I'll be a first or a twelve. <laughs> I am going to get you a job. A job? A job, yes. What do I want? I've retired. I don't care you retired. I'm fed up with you mooching about the house all day. Oh, yes, you mooch. mooch. You do nothing but mooch I these days. Know what, I know what smooching is. I don't know what mooching is. <laughs> I know you know what smooching is. I've no doubt about that. Mooching is you sitting at that stupid television with a remote control watching those ridiculous daytime television Dude, programs. Right. They're very educational and intellectual. <laughs> educational and intellectual? Daytime television? Yes. Well, what educational and intellectual programs have you been watching today? Jeremy Cole, <laughs> Trish, and Lucy Wiggle. Remember it 
your memory. Well, it does go now and again. Your memory does, that's true. I climbed into bed with her the other night. Yeah. And I put the arms around her and she said, get off, you got it. And I couldn't believe you won. <laughs> <laughs> well, what you ought to do really is you ought to go and see a doctor about that. Well, I did. You did? Go yeah. see the doctor. And he gave me this boy after a drink. A Viagra drink? Yes. You don't get Viagra drink. Viagra comes in little pills, little pink pill packs of six. Oh, you know. So I've got that. <laughs> You've got a problem. I have not got a problem. <laughs> there is no, shut up. There is no such thing as a Viagra drink. What's a Viagra drink? But well, you mix it with milk and drink it before you go to bed at night, like cocoa. You drink it before you go to bed, mix it with milk like cocoa. Yeah. And what's that supposed to do for you? So as you can pour yourself a stiff one. There's a few folks quite you, like that idea, yeah. we can tell. Yeah. Yes. Now listen, they don't give you Viagra drinks. They, they give you advice, doctors, when you've got things well, like Well, this. he gave me advice. What you? advice did he give you? He said, Ken, he said, the thing that get you on your feet, yes. if you go home and make love 15 times a month, Go home and make love 15 times a month. Yes. And that'll get you on your feet. Yes. Think about that one for a second. Because <laughs> no wonder you've got bad knees. <laughs> Go home and make love 15 times a month. Yes. So what did you do? So I went home and I said to her, he said, I've got to make love 15 times a month. And what did she say? Put me down for two. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put your hands up, I have to say. Especially the blokes. Now, listen to me, listen to me. I am going to get you a job because you, the way you talk, it sounds like an absolute nightmare. It really does. I what? Can I go off script in a minute? Can you go off script? I'd like you to go on it occasionally. If there's a script for this sketch, I want to see it. And more importantly, I want you to see it. Well, the other night I had a dream. Did you? Yeah. Talking about nightmares. Go on. And our guitar player was in it, Steve. Really? And so was Ashley. Oh. And you. Me? Yeah. I was thinking of a drink with these two. And you do it and gone ahead. Oh, well, that's understandable. And some Peter was in the game. Yeah. You know all these things. Works with the RAC, does he say? Yeah. <laughs> Jack Walker. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, now look, lads, he said, this is a massive great place up here now, yeah. and it's all computerized, and you need transport to get it out. Well, you would, yes. Yeah. So he said, but it depends on how faithful you've been to your partner <coughs> down below to what transport you get. Uh, what is this? Hang on a minute. Just three of, just, 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 yeah. The three of us have died. Yeah. We've gone to heaven. Yeah. So Peter, evening all, yeah. going to give us transport, but yeah. it depends on how faithful we've been. Yes. Is this going anywhere? Yes, just, just down. <laughs> so he says to him, he says, you've been the biggest rascal ever. Well, yes. He says, you've chased everything in a skirt. Yes, and yes. And treasure. We've got to be shot down again. And he said, you, he said, have got a bottom of the range Skoda. Serves you right, man. And then he says to him, you've been a rascal as well, but not as bad as him. And you've got a middle of the range Escort. And then he comes to you. <laughs> And he said, whiter than driven snow, you couldn't be. He said, you haven't put a foot wrong, or even a finger wrong. <coughs> You've done nothing at all. You've got a top of the range Rolls Royce. Well, you see, sin doesn't pay, folks. It and he doesn't. opened the gates, and he said, there you are, there's your cars, in you go. Quiet. And after a couple of minutes, you were screaming, shouting, crying throwing a massive tantrum, banging on the top of the car. I don't understand, why was I so upset when I just got a brand new Rolls Royce? You just saw your wife go by on a skateboard. <laughs> The pilot. The pilot. And he said, we 
we've got some bad news and some good news. Really? What was yeah. the bad news? The bad news is, he said, we've been hijacked. Oh. And the good news? He wants to go to Disneyland. <laughs> Transport, I have now created my first roundabout. <laughs> 